sexy I'm and when angry. your breath smells like toothpaste. <laughs> Welcome back to my channel today. This is an outdoor set because we came to have pizza and have a conversation. I was talking relationships. So we came up with questions that we're going to ask each other and answer as well. <laughs> and basically get ready to learn new things and know more about me and him in a relationship. Your name is Casey by the way. It's good look Casey on Instagram. You should this check girl, it out. She's very bad though. She could not even introduce me. She could not introduce me. But I did me. finally like who's this? Human beings. Anyways, let's get right into it. First question: What's the best place to meet a boyfriend or a girlfriend? Anywhere, man. Come behind the market. Market. Market is the best place to meet a girlfriend. I like to say anywhere, but see, guys, we're in Lagos, VGC. Ah, mad. See, we are walking on the road here. I tell you, five minutes. Somebody must stop for you. Rich and a cheat versus broke and faithful. Or more real guy who's loyal. If I'm with a rich guy who's a cheat, I cheat too. And I don't want to cheat, so real guy who's loyal. If you're a flip school, these girls ain't loyal. Me? I'm going to be making all the money now, so I don't care if she's rich or broke. So, <laughs> as long as she's faithful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Best hangout spot for singles in Lagos, Nigeria. At home. <laughs> Stay at home. Don't mind the beach. In the beach, there's your family members, there's everybody, and you can even meet somebody at the beach. Can you stay celibate in a relationship till marriage? Duh. Duh. Yes. I love you. What's that? Can you, can you say? I don't know. I want to do it. I'm still working on it though. I'm doing it now. Best time to be this virgin. Until you're married. <laughs> Mary, when you get married, you get these virgins. Yes. I'm married because man, erotica is a bad drug. It's worse than <laughs> marriage. So marriage, marriage, yeah, marriage. Mm, marriage. <laughs> <laughs> Can you have a threesome with your spouse? Nah. Why? I thought I thought guys like threesomes too. Like why can't you have it? What if, what if now I love my spouse and that friend now can make mad sense? Now we're in a relationship. I just try to deal with two strangers. <laughs> First of all, I can't have a threesome. It feels, it, it feels to me like it's, it's, the, it's the highest level of sin. I'm sorry, but it feels to me like, it feels to me like God doesn't be like, are you my child anymore? Like I can't, I, I can't do it with someone. What's the best Valentine gift to give your boyfriend? I know now this is like love season, yeah. A self-made card. Okay. You know, then some flowers. Although Nigerian girls don't appreciate that. Then I don't say cake. Cake is trash, man. Cook something nice for him first of all. Cheap. <laughs> Get him a perfume. Oh yes, best. Valentine's gift for your boyfriend, yeah? Go on Instagram, check the handle justmen underscore ng. They have the best Valentine gifts for your boyfriend. Like after going to their page, you'll be inspired. Everything you see there, get one, 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 one for your boyfriend. That's it, my love. And for me too. I don't understand. I did it too. <laughs> yeah. There's enough cases for everybody, yeah. So Okay. So your longest relationship, eh? How long was it? Two years and some more. Right. See how I make all my questions personal? Well, anyway, yeah. So what is that? So, moving on. Two years and some months. Let's see about this oh, is three so years. Mm. Two years, yeah. Mm. Well, let's, I was saying two years because let's say it was about two years and 11 months. So just. It was in the 12 no. months that. So now was, for Mary now, we can't do it. Really, three years. But I did two years. So. When people when people don't date nine years, they tell me. Still break up. Carry yeah. ring for four years and so. <laughs> Lord of the ring. <laughs> what is the best way to deal with a breakup? How big? Just be quiet, don't say anything, cut off all communication. Oh, Take it off. And just 
enjoy yourself, take yourself out, buy yourself stuff, pay attention to yourself, hang out with friends. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, give it time. Delete all pictures. Don't no, no, look for rebound though. First of all, first, first, okay, let me say something very important here. While you're even dating, try not to cram his number, yeah? Because you see, people, some, some people just, some people know the number. Whether it is not their phone, they don't deserve it. No. <coughs> don't cram the number so that when you take it off your phone, it is gone. Because you need that person to be out of your life oh. so you can move on, yeah? You have an ex yeah. that you regret breaking up with. Ah, that's below the bell. Uh, I think we all do. But I've moved on. Do you have? <laughs> Can you leave with your with your like spouse for a year, even when you're not married? I think so. Uh, have, you, have you done it before? So no, I just got into that space where I live with my uh, with my spouse. So now nah. I can't see. Is it that we're married or we're not married? We were not married. Let's not act like we're married. I feel like we we'll just clash a lot. I feel like we we'll break. I feel like when we're married, then we can now commit to staying with our excesses but when we're still dating nah you gotta pick one okay bad bread or body order oh, no. body order man body order <laughs> i can't do bad bread how <laughs> how bad bread chewing gum can help body order and bad and perfume oh, as in killer combo <laughs> you that you chew, 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 chew. be on the bed communicating other love talk yeah okay? i love you <laughs> what Body order, I can't do that. She'll brush her teeth before she goes to bed. She'll feel very insecure because she's like, why are you giving me chewing gum every time? So that if you want all this chewing gum. <laughs> you don't want to chew chewing gum, let's break up. Break up, are you serious? Straight up. Baby, why, 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 why? They say we should brush twice a day. I'm like brushing every time you want to make out. Baby, why are you back? I'm not doing it today. It's sexy I'm and when angry. your breath smells like toothpaste. <laughs> Can you date a girl who is making more money than you? Depends. Oh, Most of the time, no. But Most of the depends. time, no. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know, I I just, I've been around some rich girls, man. You don't want to date a rich girl or a girl. Women kind of like become monsters. You know, money to understand. They don't become monsters when they have more money. And they know they have more money. You know? Have you had an experience before? Yeah, you know, it's something about a guy when you date a girl, sometimes just you know, you gotta be a man, but you know, say the care, they keep people, you know, like you won't tell us you can be run now, you will come that insult to. I think it's after mentality, you know, with the fact that guys want to be spending because in Nigeria, let's be real, it's a lot of percentage of guys that spend to girls that spend in life, really. So, so, so I think because of that. A lot of girls might expect the guy to spend or spend more than they spend. But can I date a guy who uh, who is broke at that, who I make more money than? So it depends on where you're going to. If I'm sure that you know in the next some years uh, or some months or some days you're going to make you're, you're going to be strong and you're going to make money, then I can date you. Because again, I don't want someone to tell me that I have ego problem. I don't want someone to be intimidated by me. Nah. Can you date your friend's ex? <laughs> Knowing that when your friend and that ex they were dating them, your friend no like that guy at all. No send the guy. See, not just because the guy gave. No, maybe the guy that pity. She just pity the guy. The guy too disturb her, disturb her. She just say yes, but she hates the guy. Bah. Then they come, then how they broke up, and then now the guy like this. Can you date that guy? Are you finding him attractive? Let me sit down very well for this question. See, there's a verse in the Bible, yeah, that says, The heart of man is desperately wicked. Who can fathom it? Whether your friend hated the guy or did not hate the guy, they can kill you on top <coughs> say you're dating. And worse still, your friend is now single. You're not just that. I cannot do it. Never. Never. Girls are very sensitive human beings. Anything can trigger anything. I cannot do it. Knowing the guy not send the babe and the babe uh, makes sense and they're broken up. I think guys can do well. I would take the babe. My account, so let me know. Right, the, 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 right, might not marry because you know sometimes see finish good day. Mm. So, but if you're a girl, don't do it too. Don't, don't do it too. I'm telling I'm begging you. Like, no. 
there are a lot of guys you know don't do it at all i beg you what is your deal breaker in a relationship disrespect i don't know i've broken up someone because of disrespect before a lot of guys hate disrespect it was not she didn't cheat though but there, was, there was some. I feel so sad. You know, I said, you babe, use, use me compared to our last born. What? No, but it depends on how she said it now. Did she no, say like very. That, that day, I just tell her, Mama, I said, babe, no, in a, in a relationship first time. Until today, I look around. I feel like. Me cheating, man. Cheating. That's it. Once you just cheat on me, I know. I'm sorry, man. In conclusion, I am um, really advise a girl, you know, in a relationship with a guy, just to have one thing. Guys say big things with small actions, so no, don't overlook things, be calm, um, pay attention, pay attention to detail, man. Just pay attention to detail. A lot of four guys said they are four guys, but you're not listening. Pay attention to detail. Pay attention. And you're good. For a guy, don't compare her to any other person, her ex, her friend. Don't say, oh, oh my God, I had, I had, I had this story here yeah, where somebody said, look at what you're wearing. Even your roommate now, she look fine because it's fair. Don't do that nonsense. Like, do you get me? Like, no. If you want yeah, to date your roommate, date her roommate. What if the clothes look fine? On then tell her. Girls? Then tell her. No, don't compare and say your roommate. Tell her it doesn't suit your color. It doesn't suit your color. Get another color. You get me? Don't come and say your roommate. Your bl- who are you dating, bro? Who are you looking at, bro? Maybe the roommate. So move on with move on to the room with I leave the girl alone. Anyways, it was lovely hanging out with you and having this conversation. I had fun, it was nice talking to you. And please subscribe to my channel and yeah. Check me out on Instagram and on Facebook and every social media platform you're on and talk to your homie everywhere. And you know I love you, right? Yeah. Um, <laughs> bye bye. <laughs>